Kelly, I Yeah, Kelly, my name is Michael Bramper. You left a message for me about a, uh, a bridge engineer position. Yeah, how are you, sir? I'm fine. Thank you for returning. Thank you for calling. Oh, you're very welcome. Very welcome. Yes, yeah, looking at your experience, it seems as, uh, that you may be well qualified for this role. Uh, so I thought I'd reach out to you, see if there were any questions that I might be able to answer for you, Michael, uh, either about the role and or Mark Thomas. No, I know about Mark Thomas. I've been in the Bay Area for years, so I know quite a bit about Mark Thomas. Great, great. So. Okay. Yeah, and, and it looks like you've been either, you've hanged your, hung your own shingle or worked as a freelance consultant or... Yeah, I, I've yeah, basically a bit of both. So I've been a contract employee for twelve years. I've been all over the West Coast, and I just want to stay home. And uh, Got it. that's what I'm calling. And I know you guys have the bridge work. So <laughs> very good. Yeah, we we do we do quite a bit of bridge design um, work uh, for you know different clients, Caltrans. Um, DOT, um, local municipalities, also local state, state and local governments, whomever may have a need for uh, design work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it looks like you've got your SE, which is great. Yes. In California, and then you've got your PE in a few other states. Yep, I have the, actually the SE is actually, you know, as soon as I... Uh... Got that the PE I applied for the SE. Washington State requires it for certain bridge projects and certain building projects. So it's now California has different laws. Like California schools and hospitals, the SE. Washington State is cert. It's a lot for the SE license. It's more uh, like for complicated bridges, you have to have an SE. Uh, buildings over a certain height require it. So each each state is different, is what I'm saying. Yes, I have seen that be quite the case. Excellent. Uh, and yeah, we have the complex bridge need uh, in which you applied for. Um, and so it's great that you will most likely be, be well positioned for that. Uh, you may, um, I'm curious to know, do you have a range, a compensation range you're looking to be within? Uh, I was thinking in the 170 range, somewhere in there. Uh, in this market now with the SE, it's, you know, people with the SE, they don't go below 130 these days, 130K. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so 170, just so I'm clear, 170. Yes. Okay, got it. Okay. And my I'll question, take that. Yep. My question for you is, uh, what is the, yeah, what do you define as a complex bridge? That is a fair question, uh, and I had better defer it to the hiring manager. Because I'm okay. Not, as, yeah, as you can imagine, I'm not very well versed uh, <laughs> as a recruiter. I know just enough to be dangerous. <laughs> cool. Um, yeah, yeah. My goal is to, to, you know, get you in front of the hiring managers, and, and hopefully he can, you can then obviously ask any questions you may have. Um, okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, any additional questions? Let's see. What's after this phone screen? What's the next step in the process, and how? Why is the position available? And when do you expect to fill it? Okay, so we have uh, recently hired a leader in the Bay, and that's why this position is available. So it's a new opportunity. He's kind of starting up his own complex bridge division. Um, how soon? We'd love to fill this yesterday, but I would imagine two weeks or so, maybe. Um, you know, we, we move pretty quick. Uh, this role, we could get an offer out within a week. We do two rounds of interviews. There could be... I, you know, ideally in person, but we can do virtual as well or a combination thereof. Yeah, um, it depends where it is, obviously, you know. Yeah. If it's here in San Jose, yeah. I don't have a problem going there. You know, if it's in San Jose, you know. Yeah, we, um, he's, in, he's in the city and you're in San Jose, so virtual may make the most sense. Okay, okay. Maybe. When you say the city, yeah. you're talking and San Francisco. Maybe... Sorry. You're talking about San Francisco, right? right? When you say in the city? Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, that's exactly right. He's okay. in San Francisco. Okay. Yeah, because I'm near Bart. Yeah, right. I don't know where in San Francisco you guys are, so. Oh, yeah. No, we're, we have an office in Oakland, uh, Walnut Creek, and San Jose. So, 
you know, you may be able to work out of the San Jose office, although we have moved into a hybrid work environment. So. Yeah. In the San Jose office or maybe working directly out of the Walnut Creek office, we can, we can work that out. Um, and maybe the, one of the interviews can be done in the Walnut Creek office. You can, guys can kind of meet in the middle, maybe? Yeah, that'll be fine. Yeah, I can drive up. That's an hour. That's not much. I'm trying to see where you guys are yeah. in uh, Oakland because I'm trying to see. I live near BART. Yeah, yeah, okay. I, yeah it's 19th Street Station. I know where that is, so <laughs> I've been <Yeah>. up there. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, yeah, that sounds good. That sounds great. Yeah, I'll definitely get that over, um, this information over. Um, so, your Complex Bridge, how many years would you put your Complex Bridge experience? Well, that, that depends what the Complex Bridge is. Here's what's happened. I've been designing and reviewing s structures, and I got involved in bridges because what's happened is when the building market takes a, a dive, then the bridge market pulls up. So I designed a few of them here in the Bay Area, you know. And then I did one in Qatar. That was an airport bridge. That was with V-shaped v Excuse me, V-shaped columns. Okay. And then when I was working in Austin, I reviewed a bunch of bridges because they, you know, there they have a lot of flooding, so you see a lot of bridges there, you know. Because they want water to flow, you know, they're uh, on rock, so, he's, you know, they care about flooding. And let's see, I designed one for BART, it was a tunnel, and that was over at Milpeat by Great Mall. So, that was a tunnel under a freeway, and then, let's see, I'm trying to think of the other ones that I've worked on. That's pretty much it. That sounds good. Yeah. So, I put a link on the website on my resume, so you could look to see if it's a complicated, if it's a complex bridge or not. I just want to ask about it. So before, you know, because we may have, I may have a different version of what a complex bridge is right. compared to. Yeah, you know. that's fair. Um, yeah, I'll just make note of that and send that to to the hiring manager. I think that's a fair question. Um, yep. Yeah, because I've done, yeah, I did one for a transit structure a long time ago. They wanted to put transit on a bridge, so I got to do that. So that was a study. Right. Okay. Excellent. Okay. Sounds good. Yeah, I think I have all I need. Um, next steps will be that I will, as I obviously get your resume from hiring manager, uh, get his input. Hopefully, he's like, yeah, let's let's talk. And if that is the case, then I will have my recruiting coordinator, Victor Cruz, reach out. Yep. And he will get you all scheduled for for your formal interview. Okay, that'd be great. Thank you so much, Kelly Mitchell. Oh, you're very welcome, Michael. Thank you so much for your time. Yep. Bye bye. Bye bye. And that was Kelly Mitchell with Mark Thomas at nine sixteen eight hundred seven five eight zero.